whenever you are hooking up a switch like this, this is just a regular toggle switch, just a, a regular single pull switch for a uh, single light source. Um, whenever you're hooking something like this in a plastic box, or any box for that matter, you need to make sure it is grounded. Now the proper procedure for grounding a, um, a switch like this is to use what's called a pigtail. So what we've done is we have a uh, a cable coming in from our source where our power is going to come in. Of course we have our hot, our neutral, and our ground. And then we have a piece of Romex or cable going up to, in this case, a, a lamp, a light, uh, that would be mounted in the ceiling or something. And we have our hot already hooked up to our um, up to our top of our switch, the top post. So whenever we turn this on, it will send the electricity up to our our load, which in this case is a light. Now, the neutrals will be wire nutted together, and that's in a different demonstration that you'll see. So, today we're going to, or in this video, we're going to focus on how to do what we call a pigtail. Now, what a pigtail is, is a short strand of wire that we are going to wire nut to these grounds and connect to what's called the ground screw. If you look at here, there's a little green screw on the switch itself. So, the way we're going to do that is we are going to take a short length of Romex. We already have one cut off and I've stripped some insulation off of it already. And what we're going to do is we're going to take our pliers and we're just going to carefully pull and squeeze that out. So now I have just the bare copper. We'll put the rest aside. Now in order to do the pigtail, and this is, I don't know, maybe six inches long. You don't want it really short but you don't want it, you know, 13 inches long either. So about six inches is pretty good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, just like in the wire nut videos uh, you'll see in this, in this module, all you do is you connect the three together or hold them together tightly. Use your linesman's pliers. Do very slowly and gently. Twist the wires together like this. So you have a nice tight curl. Nice tight twist to them. Go ahead and snip it a little bit, and then you take a wire nut and you go ahead and snug that up. Give it a little tug, not going anywhere. So this now gives us what we call our pigtail. Now in order to connect this to our post, all we have to do is loosen up this ground screw with the appropriate screwdriver. Take our pigtail. Put a little hook on the end. Remember we want this going to the right around the left side of the screw so it's hooking over to the right. <clears throat> then we're going to go ahead and pull that tight and snug it up around that ground screw. Just like that. Make sure that's nice and tight on there. So then when you put it into the box you're just going to neatly fold this back into the box. Of course, you're going to wire nut these <coughs> neutrals together. And then you're going to go ahead and tuck everything nice and neat back into the box and screw it in. So that is how we do what we call a pigtail to properly ground your switch.